Okay, well, thank you very much for inviting me onto your lobster boat. And uh, I'd like to go through the day and, and talk about what I saw and what exactly is going on. Go right ahead. All right. What do you want to know? All right, we put everything on the boat. And the minute we left the dock and you're going out to sea, I noticed that right away everybody's working. You had uh, two guys working with you. They're cutting up heads and they're baiting the traps or whatever they're doing. But they were constantly working. Yeah, they get paid well. <laughs> <laughs> they should yeah. be constantly working. Now, we're out there and uh, you had a hook. And you took the hook and you hooked the line and brought in the buoy. But you the brought gaff, it in, you, yeah. yeah, the gaff. Okay, is that what that thing's called? That hook thing? It's a gaff. Yep. Okay, all this terminology. And then you took the line and you put it over the lock thing and then you turned it on and the string started coming up until you, a trap came up. Yep. When you take the buoy out, you were sticking it in this hot water right in front of you and a little place where you could put the buoy. What's the purpose of putting this buoy just, in this hot water? Just to clean the uh, growth. You get a lot of growth um, on, the, on the line and the traps. It just keeps it all clean. Less drag on the buoy and on the line and keeps your boat cleaner. So you put in the line, you put the buoy in the hot water, the line comes in, traps come up, and you push it over to your first mate, and the first mate He's taking the lobsters out. I mean, this guy's fast. He's checking and making sure there's certain sizes. What exactly is the size limit? Three and three sixteenths inches from the eye socket to the end of the carapace. Well, I noticed there was one lobster that was actually, it looked like a size you could keep, but you threw the lobster back. Yeah, Why was, a, was that? Uh, females, any egg-bearing females, you throw back. And how do you know that it's a female lobster with eggs? Well, you can see the eggs if it has eggs, but even a female lobster, um, that has its right um, fin marked with a V, you got to throw it back anyways. Well, how do you know it has eggs? You can see them, they're usually black, massive, ah, tiny, tiny eggs. So you look under the, the uh, female, oh, there's it's so you black. Check, you check every lobster to make sure there are no eggs on it. And that's, you know, it's a female, it's not notched. You see the, the black eggs under it, under the tail, and then you give it a notch and you throw it back. And then any other lobsterman that catches that same female will just throw it back immediately. Meanwhile, your second mate was taking the traps and I noticed he was putting bait bags, rebaiting them with the fish heads. And when you get done and you come in and there you have it, the lobster catch of the day. And unload.